So in this video, I'm going to explain the real-time page data exchange specification, which is used to publish open data. So all we're really doing here is synchronizing data between the data publisher and the data consumer. The small constraint here, though, is that the data publisher is publishing open data, so it can't know anything about the data consumer. This means that as the data publisher doesn't know anything about the data consumer, it's up to the data consumer to request updates from the data publisher. These updates are requested in pages. And when the data consumer has read all the pages from the data publisher, then the data consumer is fully up to date. So once the data consumer is up to date, any additional changes are sent via new pages. So only the delta, only the changes are sent. So how do we create these pages? So first, imagine an infinite list of all of the records in the database, sorted by modified date and then by ID. Because of the way the list is sorted, any record that gets updated will move to the bottom of the list. So for a data consumer to stay up to date, they just need to poll the bottom of the list. Importantly, each page is defined by the last modified date and ID on the previous page. This means that even if the contents of the previous page changes, the last modified date and ID act as an anchor to ensure that the next page can still be retrieved 